Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Avilash and I'm a trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of gold USD. So if you're watching my videos for the first time, you can subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis. So let's get started. Before I proceed, I would like to mention that from tomorrow onwards, tomorrow and day after tomorrow, I'll be conducting my last workshop. So if you're interested in learning, you can check out the link in the description because I will not be teaching for a while. This will be the last workshop. Okay, so the link is in the description. If you are interested, you can check it out. Now let's talk about the chart of gold. Right now, the chart of gold is consolidating. Okay, after the CPI, also we could see that there was not much volatility. There is a sluggishness, dullness going on in the market right now. Right now, gold is trading at 1854. This is the current market price here. Yeah. So let's discuss the chart and the trading opportunities. So as I just said, the market is consolidating. So as a result, it will be wise for us, safe for us to look for 40, 40 to 50 pips max per trade. Okay. Because a trader should be very flexible. Keep in mind, the flexibility is the most important thing that will help you to survive in the market in this market do not expect any trend reversal because we don't have any sign yet okay so as long as we do not get any trend reversal sign or any any uh, sudden movement sign okay it is better to book 30 40 50 picks per trade and right now market is consolidating this is the best strategy you can follow as of now because survival in the market is very very important as you can already see that market is in downtrend okay the market is in downtrend you can see the market is constantly constantly forming lower highs in the market or in simple words market is unable to cross the previous highs and still we can see that though market is trying to go up but market does not have the buying power the pull power okay so as a result the selling pressure is still present in the market okay. and in this case in this case we can see that there is a possibility of market reversing from the blue line that you can see here. The blue line is the 50 moving average. If you do not have the 50 moving average in your charting platform, you can use it. 50 moving average really works well in the forex market. So there is a good chance that around 50 moving average market will face some selling pressure and there is a possibility of reversal as well. 50 moving average is a dynamic resistance. As a result, I cannot give you the exact figure. Dynamic support resistances uh, are dynamic. That's why we do not have the exact figure. So, still, I can so we can expect that around 1962-65 level, there can be some selling pressure. And if market reverses from the 50 moving average, okay, well and good, we can take a sell position. But keep in mind, that confirmation will be very very important if you see that market is forming a red candle or if you see that market is forming a shooting star kind of a pattern at the resistance at the 50 moving average then only take a sell position before the 50 moving average we have another resistance around 1862 around 1862 we have another resistance okay but you must be very very careful because personally okay i am not much sure or i'm not much confident about this level if you want to take a sell position if you see any opportunity that is your personal opinion personal mm, call if you want to take a sell position you can take a sell position but i'll say that you must be very very careful while taking a sell position around 1862 but yes there is a good chance of market reversing from the 50 moving average and that can be a trading opportunity and in case in case there is a sudden bullishness in the market if you see sudden buying in the market and market breaks the 50 moving average then around 1871 to around 1872 or 1872 around 1872 we have another selling zone in the market okay this selling zone has been derived from the fibonacci fibonacci 23.6 percent retracement level this so if market goes up and hits the 1872-71 level, if you see that price is uh, struggling around this level, you can also take a sell position. Again, I say do not expect any trend reversal. It is wise and better to book your profits once you have achieved 30, 40, 50 pips. 
and if you are if you have the considerable experience in the market if you know how to tackle the market if you have been playing the charts for a long time then you can be on the trade because you know how to take position exit from the position and all okay but new traders beginners you should be booking your profits after 30 or 40 max to max 50 pips okay. but in case there is a sudden trend reversal then that's a different chapter you can be on the trade but whatever it is survival is most important as i always say Capital protection is mostly important because most of the new traders, you all do not follow risk management. That's a very bad thing. Keep in mind, no strategy, no analysis is 100% accurate. As a result, it's your responsibility, our responsibility to protect our capital, isn't it? So protect your hard-earned money. So this is the scenario if market goes up. But in case market comes down, then the things may be a little bit critical. Why? Because overall, we have seen the market is constantly forming lower highs and breaking the previous lows as well. So see, I have mentioned here as critical because see, 1832 uh, to 1835, this is a support zone from the weekly chart. We have already discussed, I do not want to bore you again. So this is a support zone from the weekly chart. So yes, there is a possibility. There is a possibility that market will try to bounce again and we may get a profit of 40, 50 pips. But market is constantly forming this pattern. So as a result, you must be careful. If you see that market is trying to bounce, if you see that market is trying to take support, then only place, uh, click on the buy button. If you see that market is standing at the support but market is forming a big red candle, do not take any buy position because market will be breaking the support because this is not a very strong support also as of now we do not have any strong support right now in the market and that's why i do not want to uh, stretch the video further so you must observe the market around this table try to understand the market psychology one thing you must understand my dear friends that no level is permanent in the market observation is the only thing okay that will that will lead you to the sky so observation practice experience those are the very important things okay anyways whatever you do follow proper risk management protect your hard and money bye bye take care